And those high level clouds from our Hershey Sky Cam coming from, yeah, from Irma. 71 degrees right now, very comfortable. The winds are calm. Going to be a nice evening if you are heading out, though. Take a sweater. And temperatures quickly fall into the 50s. I think it's almost fall like overnight tonight. Lower 50s. Could even be a few upper 40s out in the countryside. Some of the river valleys and some of the uh, river routes may have a little bit of patchy fog. Shouldn't be a problem. Sunshine will filter through some high clouds. We're going to have these waves of clouds coming over us. Again, they're very high up in the atmosphere, kind of thin, and they allow the sun to get through. I think it's another nice day for the most part for tomorrow. Now, moderate pollen count back up again tomorrow, and the air quality tomorrow is moderate and very little wind out there. We're starting to get some particulates building up a little bit. Seven for the burn time, about a 25 minute burn time for tomorrow. If you missed it, Irma, right near Albany, Georgia, uh, just about 10 miles to the northeast of it now and continuing to the move to the northwest and it'll curve around in the western parts of Kentucky around midweek. As it does that, some of its moisture is going to blow off toward us, more clouds and maybe some showers, but nothing serious. Now we have Irma. We also still have Jose out there, a Cat 2 uh, hurricane with 100 mile an hour winds, uh, just about 360 miles to the northeast of the Grand Turk Island. It's forecasted to make a loop as we go through this week and then start heading to the north and west toward the coast as we go toward the weekend. Does it make it to, a co to the coast? Does it stay out to sea? Uh, stay with us. We got a little ways to go on that one. Could affect the east coast early next week. We still have Irma down there. That's bringing these high level clouds our way. No real warm weather either. A lot of 70s all across the northeast with the rain. Of course, it's a little cooler down south. We're going to see these high level clouds through the evening and pretty much right through tomorrow. They'll be kind of in and out. There'll be times when they're uh, completely sunny. Other times when it's yeah, a little thicker cloud cover. Temperatures though, like I said, fall quickly into the 50s and then bottom out in the low to mid 50s overnight tonight. I think it's a cool night despite those clouds out there. And then tomorrow, pretty pleasant day back into the mid 70s. And again, we'll have those waves of high clouds coming on through for tomorrow. So tomorrow's not a bad day, comfortable. And then I think on Wednesday and Thursday, we have a few showers in the forecast. Certainly not a washout and certainly nothing heavy to be concerned about. Some of the moisture could get trapped over us even going into the weekend. Now, while we have a chance of showers each day, I want you to check back with us. We may be able to take some of those showers out, especially as we get into Sunday. Sunday could turn out to be a real nice day. It